Hello friends, a very warm welcome to Rouse Academy for Competitive Exams. Uh, friends, I was speaking with many of my students and I have heard their problems and anxiety and then I thought I should come up with some video which would really be helping you at this point of time. Abhi jo 26-27 days hai, so to the prelims, this is the right time when you uh, approach the exam in a right way. Because abhi jo gadbad hua, to pura saal bar ka mehnat, it will be gone. So it is the right time, it is a very crucial time and I want you to please follow some uh, very strict regime and uh, suggestions so which would take you to your destiny. So this I would uh, like to call it as a rescue my prelims, uh, you know, video. So it's a, some kind of suggestions for you to do some things and not to do some things, do's and don'ts. So I'm Chirant Rashekar. So you might have seen me in my previous videos. Uh, I'll straight away go with the suggestions, right? See, the first and foremost suggestion is do not get excited. So I know that everybody would be facing a pre-examination anxiety right now. Both sare aap apne dost ki baas jate ho, waha poochte ho ki apne kitna padha. Oi bolte hai ki mera pura padh liya ho, mein revision kar raha ho. Aap se poochha ke ta aap bhi oi bolenge ki haa mera bhi ek bar revision ho gaya, dousra bar ho na hai. And you know most of the times it's not true. But A bolte hai baut sare bachche just to make sure that you know just to not to look low in front of your friends. And believe me, jo aap kar raha hai wohi cheez wohi kar raha hooga. So it's very... A mutual so most of the students they think that abhi tak to mera pura ek bar optional hona chahiye tha pura syllabus uh, padke ab mujhe pehla ya dusra revision mein hona chahiye tha mujhe at least 15 20 exam questions solve karna chahiye tha these are the things which you should you think you should have done and believe me most of the people would not have done it and sabhi log ek hi stage pe hai even if you have not done it, do not worry, that will not be a problem for clearing the prelims. So, abhi jo anxiety ho raha hai, abhi jo ghabrahat ho raha hai, abhi, like you know, you will start feeling ki padai nahi ho raha hai, concentrate nahi ho raha hai, minne complete nahi kiya, bohut sara cheeze hai, forget about everything. Abhi bhi, aapka ek decent level of preparation hai, agar aap class attend kiye hai, if you have made some decent notes and even if you have solved one or two question papers, that would be good enough to clear the prelims. I am telling you that you know you do not know about your capacity. Ab khud ko underestimate mat kijiye. This is the right time. Do not worry about whatever has been done. Jo hua, so hua. Forget about it. Right now, this is the time when you make sure that this gap of 25 days goes very very effectively. So forget about uh, you know anxiety. Do not get anxiety and stick to some some kind of discipline, which would actually brings you out of anxiety. Okay. So that is the first thing. Moving next, lot of people would be start watching videos right now. So पहले वो जो लोग हैं जो पूरा पूरा रात भर बैठ के सीरीज वेब सीरीज कंप्लीट करते हैं मूवीज देखते हैं. This video is not for them. UPSC is not for them. Unko to side mein rakhna hai. But people who even watch, uh, you know, videos, motivation videos. Abhi bhoat sare log search kar rahe honge how to clear prelims in first attempt. How to, uh, you know, uh, score more than 120. Tips and tricks. In fact, jo aap ye video dekh rahe ho, even though it comes in one of the category, iske baad please kuch mat dekhe. Because you will spend a lot of time in just knowing how to clear the prelims and see motivation is dangerous if no action is taken. Up motivate ho jate ho, dekhte ho video, toppers video dekhte ho, how did I clear prelim, how did I score more than 140, so how did I clear prelims in 5 times, 6 times, uh, all these wheels, isko dekhe na aapko lagta hai ki mein bhi kar raho, mein kar diya ho, you know you will get like very much overconfident or wo aapka jo dopamine produce hota hai mind mein. So that will give instant gratification. Isle you will start procrastinating. Isse immediately aapko sakoon milta hai is video se. So you will get like 
यू नो विदाउट इवन टेकिंग एक्शन यू विल गेट सेटिस्फाइड सो इसकी वजह से बहुत सारा नुकसान होता है यू विल लूज लॉड ऑफ योर प्रेशियस टाइम सो डू नॉट वॉच दिस काइंड ऑफ वीडियोज एट दिस पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम ये पहले करना था और पहले कर दिए होंगे एंड नाउ इट्स द राइट टाइम टू टेक एक्शन एंड नॉट गेट मोटिवेटेड मोटिवेशन बहुत हो गया अभी टेक कंट्रोल ऑफ योर लाइफ टेक एक्शन एंड स्टार्ट वर्किंग ऑन इट ओके सो डू नॉट वॉच मल्टीपल वीडियोज डू नॉट वॉच ऑल दिस लास्ट मिनिट यू नो थिंग्स एक्सेप्ट फॉर करंट अफेयर्स करंट अफेयर्स आपको ब्रेशअप होना है अभी तक जो भी पढ़ा है उसको रिवाइज करने की जरूरत है नो न्यू थिंग्स ऐसा कुछ नया वीडियो नया सीरीज नया कुछ अपडेट्स सो वो सब मत भी देखिए यू नो इवन इफ यू आर वॉचिंग दिस यू नो इन अ सेंस आई वुड से दैट यू नो दिस आर नॉट राइट टाइम टू डू दैट बट इफ यू आर लकीली वॉचिंग दिस आई एम सेइंग डू नॉट वॉच एनी ऑफ द वीडियोज आफ्टर दिस ऑल राइट सो नो बिंज वॉचिंग नो कंटिन्यूस वॉचिंग ऑफ वीडियोज नाउ मेनी पीपल विल स्टार्ट स्काउटिंग द मार्केट मार्केट जाते हो वहां देखते हो कि लाइक यू नो वेरी स्मॉल बुक एंटायर ईयर करंट अफेयर्स स्मॉल समरी ऑफ सम यू नो एक्स वाई जेड सब्जेक्ट उसका पूरा दस पेज में सब कुछ हो जाएगा थर्टी डेज थर्टी पेजेस में पूरा आपका दो साल का करंट अफेयर्स है ना ऑल दिस बकवास चीजें मिलता है मार्केट में एंड ऑल दिस मटीरियल स्टार्ट प्रोड्यूसिंग राइट नाउ एंड उसको आप पढ़ते हो बहुत अट्रैक्टिव रहता है टाइटल वगैरह डो नॉट रीड इट उससे कोई फायदा नहीं होने वाला है जो वो पढ़ोगे तो आपका पुराना जो आ, सीखा हुआ चीज है उस पर भी इफेक्ट पड़ेगा सो राइट नाउ डो नॉट पिक एनी न्यू सोर्सेस जो आप नई पढ़े हैं तो नई पढ़े हैं फॉरगेट अबाउट इट पर जो पढ़े हैं मेक श्योर दैट उससे कोई क्वेश्चन मिस नहीं होना चाहिए यू शुड नॉट मिस एनी क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम वॉट यू हैव ऑलरेडी लर्न वॉट यू हैव प्रैक्टिस वॉट यू अटेंडेड द क्लासेस जो आप लिखे हो जो आप एक बार भी पढ़े हो that will be a good thing to get revised so revision is the key revision 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 nothing else so this is a time when you do not hunt for new sources new books right that's one thing so study whatever you have already prepared then keep distance from negative thoughts and negative people bahut sare cheeze aata rehta hai ki is bar chhod dunga is bar chhod dungi abhi abhi se next year ke liye prepare karenge I will not take the attempt because prelims तो हो जाएगा पर mains नहीं होगा बिल्कुल बकवास है okay so अगर इस बार नहीं हो रहा है तो next time भी इसी time पे next prelims में यही stage होगा do not worry okay ऐसा thoughts आ रहे हैं तो उसको निकाल दो इस बार अगर prepare किए हो थोड़ा बहुत भी and अभी एक महीने है and if you want to give the prelims give it and it will happen give it with confidence यही time है Do not skip the year, this year's prelims क्योंकि पता नहीं कि next year क्या क्या आने वाला है and what are the mental disturbances you might face. This is the right time. Give the exam and keep yourself away from those thoughts. अगर ऐसा thought हुआ तो take a break, you know, refresh yourself. So don't worry about अगर नहीं हुआ तो क्या है, हो गए तो क्या है, mains कैसे prepare करो, prelims नहीं हुआ है. So all these negative thoughts thoughts come come at this point of time. बहुत डिस्टर्ब करता है सो कीप अवे फ्रॉम योर नेगेटिव थॉट्स एंड ज्यादातर ये जो नेगेटिव थॉट्स है दैट कम्स फ्रॉम नेगेटिव पीपल सो कीप अवे फ्रॉम द नेगेटिव पीपल एज वेल तो बहुत सारे लोग होते हैं तुमसे नहीं होगा इस बार छोड़ दो नेक्स्ट बार पढ़ेंगे सो नेक्स्ट टाइम अच्छे से प्रिपेयर करेंगे बहुत सारे लोग जिसका प्रिपरेशन नहीं है थोड़ा भी सो दे वॉन्ट कंपनी दे वॉन्ट टू पुल यू डाउन टू देयर लेवल सो वो लोग बोलेंगे आपको कि इस नेक्स्ट टाइम हम लोग ग्रुप स्टडी करके अच्छे से देंगे इस बार छोड़ दो इस बार सीट्स नहीं है फॉरगेट अबाउट सीट्स लोग बाग मैं देखा हूं कि इस बार ज्यादा सीट है इस बार कम सीट है आपको क्या लेना देना है उससे दस सीट है तो भी कॉम्पीट करना है दस हजार सीट है तो भी कॉम्पीट करना है सो दिस दिस मैटर ऑफ नंबर ऑफ सीट्स इज एब्सोल्यूटली नॉन वो बच्चे मतलब बिल्कुल उसको छोड़ दो यू आर नॉट यू नो वन ऑफ द थिंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द सीट्स कितने भी सीट्स हो यू वॉन्ट टू सिक्योर वन One seat is yours. Us confidence se jao, and you know keep distance from those kind of negative people. Jo negative karte hai, arey chalo baad me kar lenge, arey ho jayega. Chai pi ke aate hai, kahi ghum ke aate hai, ek refresh chahiye. So those people will deviate you, and you will start, uh, you know, instantly getting attracted to their things. You know, ye mujhe care kar rahe, but they are the people who will be spoiling your future. So keep away from the negative people and negative. thoughts 
don't worry about test marks you know test marks is not the criteria to select uh, you know you getting selected for prelims so test marks kuch nahi bolte you know test is just a kind of practice okay test mein do cheez hota hai ek you will write the test very seriously you will look, look into the marks kisi ko 10 aa raha hai 20 aa raha hai 100 mein se 25 aa raha hai and your total marks will be 50 40 so people get depressed as it is to so, marks ke liye mat karo so test series aap jo test de rahe ho this is an augmentation augmentation in the sense ki jo bhi uska jo uh, test mein options diya gaya hai even the wrong options usse aapko seekhne ko mil raha hai aap apka jo taiyari hai usko thoda fill in the blanks kar rahe ho usko aap uh, you know chote 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 additions kar rahe ho so that if at all a question comes from not just the question even from the wrong options aapko wo help karega so that is why you are giving test series test series ka marks ko seriously mat lo i have seen people who score very less in test series or prelims mein clear ho gaya i have seen people who are scoring 140 150 in test series uska actual prelims clear hi nahi hua so you have both the cases do not worry about test series test series aap yahi samajh ke le lo ki aap uska marks pe nahi uska information pe dhyan de rahe ho so this is one of the major thing i have seen many people getting depressed because of test marks सी यू पी एस सी स्टैंडर्ड जो है उसको अभी तक कोई पकड़ नहीं पाया वॉट ऑल ऑफ एस डू इज प्रिपेयर सम काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन पेपर समटाइम्स इट विल बी टू मच ईजी समटाइम्स इट विल बी टू डिफिकल्ट कोई मतलब ही नहीं रहता है यूपीएससी क्वेश्चन पेपर से सो देर बी क्वेश्चन लाइक यू नो वी एक्चुअली नो बडी वुड हैव अभी तक डिसर्व यू नो उसको उसको डिस्कवरी नहीं किया है कि यूपीएससी क्वेश्चन कहाँ से उठाता है कहाँ से करता है सो डोंट वरी अबाउट इट डोंट Uh, you know trust completely that you know as a question aayega isi standard se aayega so only we can match the upsc paper upsc paper will be an entirely different game so don't worry your test series doesn't mean anything aapko 20 25 bhi mil raha hai test mein do not worry think that wo 20 25 marks ke sath sath jo 100 question ki hai uska optional se aap kitna gyan liye ho kitna uh, you know enlightened ho that's that's what you know uh, matters a lot then revision helps so the only thing the only life support life guard you have in prelims is revision without revision agar revision nahi kar rahe ho ek bar padh ke do hi mat do not go and sit just just be yourself otherwise because revision ke bina a exam possible nahi hai the more number of revisions the more you are near to the prelims aap bahut nazdeek jaoge revision is the ultimate key agar baki kuch bhi is video se le rahe ho nahi le rahe ho doesn't matter but take this point very seriously revision is the key abhi aajkal ho raha hai ki abhi videos release honge you know so entire ek subject in 10 hours marathon कंटिन्यूसली बैठ के आप दस घंटे देखो अरे दो घंटे नहीं देख पाते टू आवर्स यू कांट सिट एंड वॉच वीडियो कंटिन्यूसली फॉर टू आवर्स यूल गेट डाइजेस्टेड वो माइंड आपका लेगा ही नहीं दस घंटे कंटिन्यूसली आप बोले कि चौबीस घंटे है दस घंटे आज दस घंटे बैठ के वीडियो देखूंगी उसमें दस घंटे में कितना रिटेन कर पा रहे हो यू जस्ट वॉचिंग समथिंग लाइक ए मूवी उसमें नहीं दया जा रहा है दिमाग से मैराथन एट दिस पॉइंट विल नॉट हेल्प मे बी देर वॉज अ टाइम बिफोर वेयर मैराथन वुड हैव हेल्प रिफ्रेश के लिए रिविजन के लिए abhi marathons will not help you a lot so current affairs ka marathon chalega current affairs is like you know whenever you lay, you get to know new things usko digest kar paoge but whatever you have read jo class notes se ya koi video continuously subscribe karke ya jo bhi uh, textbook se jo bhi padhe hai ya jo bhi mind maps banaye hai aapne usi ko revision karo that is best you know 10 times better than watching a new video taught by a new teacher uh, about the same subject which you have studied in a new manner nay nay cheez nay nay tarike you will get confused so marathon will not help right now prelim uh, you know revision will actually help you a lot tuning with circadian rhythm bahut sare bacche hai bolte hai ki main raat raat tak padunga padungi 1 o'clock 2 o'clock 3 o'clock i study till 4 o'clock 5 o'clock don't do this abhi time hai agar aap aisa bhi the तो स्टॉप इट राइट नाउ सो यू शुड योर बॉडी हैज अ सरकार्डियन रिदम 
right? There is a rhythm which your body follows and uh, as soon as you wake up from the deep sleep, you will be fresh and make sure that the deep sleep, sleep happens in the night because unfortunately, exam aapka din mein rahega. Okay, so that is the time you want to be the fresh, uh, at your fresh, uh, you know, mood, fresh time. So, so ke utne ke baad jo freshness hai, that should be the morning. Because paper bhi morning mein rahega, prelims, mains, even interview happens at, in the morning time. So, it doesn't happen at night, right? So, night time aap fresh rahoge, active rahoge, both padoge, doesn't mind. It doesn't matter right now. Up start sleeping at uh, night. Okay. So 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock. And make sure that you complete 7 to 8 hours of sleep. Because that is no way you are going to compromise. If 8 hours se kam aapka sleep ho rahe abhi, then your retention power, your religion power, your energy will be reduced. It will affect your preparation. Ab zyada nahi pad paayenge, zyada energetic nahi reh paayenge. So you will not feel so good, uh, you know, in the initial time. So like, you know, whenever you are awake, you will feel like doziness, you know, some kind of dreasiness. So fatigue, anxiety and all these things. In order to be away from that, take a good eight hour of sleep uh, in complete darkness, uninterrupted. Okay, that will boost your immunity, that will recharge you completely. And that is the right time to do. And do not compromise with 8 hours of sleep. Agar padai thoda kam bhi ho gaya, to do not mind it. 8 hours of sleep is very much required from now till the date of the prelims. Even before the date of the one day before the prelims, you should have these 8 hours so that you should be, you can be at your highest energy level. Okay. So it's very night. So if you are a night owl and not a morning bird, change it right now. Abhi time hai, abhi change karlo, start sleeping. Uh, at the night and be very active in the morning. Apna circadian rhythm ko tune karo and be a early morning riser. So, time and when, if you are start reading, now uh, people say ki mein sab kuch kar leta hon, you know, I'll do everything, I'll cover entire polity in one day, I'll cover entire history in two days. So, you know, that kind of stress, don't put it on yourself. Be little easy on yourself. Aapna, aapka brain uh, need, needs a break and so is your body. So, kuch samay padne ke baad, one hour, one and a half hour. So, uh, take a break. Take a break and take, make uh, time for yourself to recharge emotionally. Emotional support is very much required. If you are there with your parents, spend time with your parents. If you have very good friends, spend, you know, 15, 20 minutes, half an hour with your friends in between and if you are like you know uh, if you are away from your parents call them talk to them speak with them you know emotionally connect with them that is very much required at this point of time so uh, that will keep you in a good pace so that's very important recharge yourself emotionally connect with your friends and family so one of the major mistake which people do is ignoring paper two paper two which usually you call it as CSAT, but the term CSAT is not there anywhere in the notification. So it is paper one and paper two. Uh, so paper two, as it's qualifying, most of the people ignore it. And I have seen many people who score more than 125, 130 in paper one, but fail to qualify paper two. So paper two is very important. Uh, paper two is basically a skill-based paper. So if you know the method, if you are calm, if you are mentally stable, you can solve it. Okay. So you do not need to remember multiple formulas and any other things. So if you have worked it, you have to, uh, you know, solve it. And this comes by practice. So abhi tak aap CSAT ko touch bhi nahi kiya ho, know how the questions are asked in the previous years. See what kind of skills are required to solve those questions and practice. At least two hours a day, keep aside. Aapka jitna bhi study hours hai, usme two hours very vigorously Keep aside for CSAT and solve the questions in the books initially and then start solving the previous year questions. So you'll get confident ki I can solve any kind of question which comes in this way. Aap, aap dekhe honge ki CSAT mein, they have certain pattern, they have certain themes which they are asking speed and time pe rahega, 
there will be question on percentage, there will be question on, uh, you know, there will be reading comprehension, there will be small paragraphs, big paragraphs. So they have certain uh, standard which they are following. Oi standard is Barbi Hoga. So know that standard, try solving and, you know, get your yourself acclimatized. So the entire CSET game is the game of time. So time management. Within the two hours, will you be able to solve the entire paper? So 33% is the requirement and utna karne ke liye kitna chahiye. Keep yourself always ahead of that deadline. Do not exactly stick to the deadline, you know, the cutoff. Thoda zyada karne ke practice karo and do not ignore it, okay. So what if I told you it's in the syllabus. Many people forget CSAT. Last day pakadte hai ki, you know, that day I'll see all those and I'll do that. That won't help. You'll not be able to do that. Do not ignore paper 2. Do not procrastinate. Oi, aaj, abhi mein bataye ki, ab padne betoge, to your mind will be under stress, ke padai kar rahe ho, and instantly you'll feel like seeing the mobile, kyunki mobile se instant gratification milta hai, infant aapko achcha lagta hai, so you will start seeing it, and aise hi do teen ghanta chala jayega. Instagram, Facebook, social media, us sab se abhi, this is the time to, you know, temporarily be out of this, okay. So, you will postpone the things which you have to do right now. Baad mein kar lenge, baad mein kar lenge. So that's called procrastination. Okay. So do not procrastinate. So kill your procrastination and start doing what you are doing. So if you are committed to do something, do it right away. So do not postpone it. So that postpone keeps on having and pata nahi chalega ki kab prelims aagaya. So procrastination is a major no. Right. So... Yeah, this one. So commit to a timetable. So always make sure that you have a timetable. Ki subha utke kya karna chahiye. Because whatever you do in the morning, that doesn't happen Doesn't happen in the morning. That happens previous night. Aapko pichle night pe pata hona chahiye ki what are you going to do in the morning and what are you going to do next day. So you, have, you should have a complete plan. So from this time to this time, I'll read current affairs. This time to this time, I'll read this subject. This I'll take a break. This I will, uh, this is a time when I, uh, you know, do CSAT. So you should have the timetable and make practical timetables. As I say, you know, today I'll complete entire history. Nahi ho pahe. Okay, so and if you do not do, you will again get depressed. So make practical timetables and stick to it. Ab, abhi se day wise, time wise, prepare your timetable till the prelims and stick to the timetable. That will help you a lot. Wo, that will keep you organized. So make sure that you follow it and repeatedly I'm saying do not make impossible timetables. So it will not help. Okay. So one thing. Believe in yourself. Many of the people might have told and you yourself might have, uh, you know, uh, felt that you can't do. So don't do that. No, you, you have a same brain. The brain of you and the brain of All India Rank 1 who has, has secured. एक ही साइज का है, उनको भी 24 hours मिल रहा था, वही बुक से जो उनको मिलता है, वही बुक्स पढ़ना है, standard books सबको पता है, standard material सबको पता है, so they would have done the same thing, and they would have, you know, been in the same anxiety which you are in right now, so you know the history, right? You know the, the person who got All India Rank One just got rescued from prelims from one marks, ऐसा कुछ है previously, I don't want to take the name. But yeah, so that has happened. So, aapko ek marks bhi cut off pe aaya, to you can be in All India rank 1 or top 10 of the country. So, do not underestimate yourself. Believe in yourself. You know, mujhe bas ye gana yaad hai, mein nahi ta koon bhe. Aap nahi kar paayenge, to aur koon kar paayenge. Believe in yourself. You are good. You know, you are the best. Okay, nobody is better than you. Aapne suna hooga, Ronaldo. Ronaldo ko jab poocha ta, who is the best? Uh, football player in the world. So other players are saying, you know, Maradona and all this. Ronaldo always says, I am the best player in the world. That is the confidence you should have. So that self-confidence is what make you achieve impossible things. Okay, humans have done incredible things. That human being is as equally capable as you. So do not worry. Do not think or do not underestimate yourself. So believe in yourself and that belief will give you confidence. You can do really impossible. Jo impossible, you can do. 
so that's all i had to offer so i wish you a very good luck for your examination i want all of you to fly with you know colorful wings and come out with colorful results so good luck for your prelims and clear it give me a good news and then we'll meet for mains thank you so much